morning to all dear students uh, from yesterday class we started the profit and loss discount and uh, tax money exchange it means arithmetic second unit we started uh, yesterday i have given some uh, formula uh, to you and the basic concepts about the uh, discount vat uh, money exchange profit and loss uh, today also uh, we discuss on the topic of discount vat uh, profit and if we have the time then we will discuss also the profit and loss okay here i am written the seven circle and side the two circle i had already taught you so today i ask you what you uh, learn study can you tell me yes in in first one circle what should be here what uh, terminology you had learned yesterday yes if here you put the label price it means mark price yes here in second one what do you do discount percent yes if you subtract from it the discount percent then what you will get discount amount and by subtracting this discount amount what you will get selling price yes good good answer now in selling price what you find from selling price if you find the vat percent yes from it if you calculate the vat percent you will get the vat amount yes vat amount and by adding this vat amount at last you will get the what selling price with vat yes vat and what here you if you write here in these two sides what you write cost price yes cp cp if you put here then by subtracting the loss l means loss yes from the cp then also you will get the selling price and by adding the profit if you are selling your goods in profit then if you add the profit then also you will get the selling price esp in this way by these concepts you can uh, uh, also uh, find out the formula easily no need to learn all the formulas whatever i uh, given you i saw in a chart also and uh, you can remember easily by this way suppose one question here try it yes what is cash payment of a bill amounting rs 1800 allowing a discount of 5% if in a bill yes suppose you are going in a market and you buy some uh, goods then you you get there yes you discount given to you the 5% discount given you then how you can find yes see for its solution easily yes amount bill amounting is here yes total yes total bill amount you can write yes rs 1800 if you suppose yes discount is given in mark price sir can i write the here mark price okay you can write yes but in question there is not written the mark price so simply no need to go by this uh, formula yes you know you you have learned the formula yes discount amount is equals to yes discount percent of mp yes and then after discount amount is equals to yes mp minus discount uh, yes um, uh, discount then you will get the what uh, selling price without discount yes yeah rsp if you write yes discount amount you will get and sp selling price if you yes we then after mp minus discount you will do e by this way but here without without you can uh, calculate your uh, formula yes by easy way yes you can here discount percent given 5% yes and then after discount amount you find easily from this bill amount yes 5% of 
1800 you do then 5% if yes then by 100 and 1800 if you yes in this way cancel this two and if you multiply 18 5 js yes, uh, yes 5 times 18 it will be i think 90 yes 90 then this is the discount amount now without discount cash payment what is the total cash payment for the cash payment yes for the cash payment amount yes what we are paying that total is 1800 yes from 1800 if you subtract the discount 90 your yes what you have to pay 1710 in this way you can find your tapai ko dainik jivan sangha tapai ko daily activity sangha tapai le bazar ma janu bhai afai saman kinna sau ji le bill jodyo total yes sab ki par yes 1800 aba discount tapai magnu bhai ule 5% discount diye pachi tapai le tyo 1800 ko you can calculate the 5% 5% of 1800 yes of means always think in mathematical term multiplication and you will find the discount and discount if you subtract from this billing amount total bill amount you will have got your what is the cash payment amount total what you are paying that amount you can calculate the easily no need to uh, learn formula formula this concepts if you find yes then you can get total yes here mark price from discount percent yes you get a discount amount then after selling price yes and if need here VAT, then you can add the VAT percent what is the VAT? yes leveling you can write their VAT. yes then you will you find the VAT amount then after you can add the VAT amount you will get the sp with that in this way we can uh, solve the questions easily by this way okay now next question let us take one more example is yes. we will try here Next question you can suppose find uh, the total uh, selling price uh, of uh, suppose goods, okay, whose who's, uh, mark price, mark price is 2000 okay suppose when that 13 percent that that is left okay add it okay l e i e d o s left it okay these questions see first selling question find the total selling price okay of a goods which Mark price is 2000 when 13% VAT is levied. How you can find? See, it is simple. Yes, mark price is given, but discount is not given here. You are, you are learning this seven circle. Yes, there you are adding the VAT while I am teaching you VAT in selling price, but in here. From mark price discount we subtract, then we get the SP, then we add the VAT, at last we get the SP with VAT. But here not the discount person given, discount is not given. Mark price given, discount not given there on a goods, direct VAT is levied, and then after we have to pay the total amounts to the yes while purchasing that goods. Therefore, uh, no need to uh, here take the tension for it. You can easily solve it. See, yes, mark price given. Okay, solution C, mark price write down. Okay, you can write mark price EMP in short form RS 2000. Okay, that rate is given here. You can write VAT rate 13% given. Now you can find the VAT amount. Okay, VAT amount. Yes, VAT amount formula you learn. VAT percent of SP. Huh? But here no SP, here MP. 
then if you use that formula it will be wrong so you have to learn the concepts at first okay here is no discount in the mp we add the vat so find out the vat amount 13 percent of this 2000 you will get the 13 uh, divide by 100 of this into do the okay then 20 cancel 13 into 22 you will get the rs 260 yes 260 that amount now at last selling price yes sp with that for the sp with that you can add yes this uh, 2000 yes in 2000 if you add 260 then you will get what at last this 2260 in this way if you try you can do this see once again i revise it okay very simple question two marks question may ask in exam find the total selling price of a goods whose mark price is 2000 yes mark price right down here when 13 percent vat is levied 13 percent vat rate like the vat amount or vat amount we can yes do 13 percent of 2000 you will get the vat amount and then after sp with vat you can add 2000 plus 260 this two if you add you will get the total price sp with vat okay in this way we can calculate uh, by uh, discount from mp if discount given in previous question uh, cash after discount payment and in vat while adding then how to add the vat Okay, directly also you can uh, write this one, then also you, you say, yes, SP with a question like the violation, SP with our summon of Heko Belama, SP with VAT is equals to 2000 plus 13 percent of 2000. Yes, sir, the file of a question, the file of Boliviana, SC, pass the repossi direct. If you go to find the S, IO, then how you do S, yes? then directly within a 30 S second. 50 second you have to find the answer then at that time 2000 plus 13 percent of 2000 tap the nigalus any you like you got the news add got the news that pens and also option particular i didn't use it done easily this mother it will amma gorilla so i go there need a child in your short questions now next question the army lago move okay very funny i am one question more bring yes you the suppose the price of a sort okay suppose with with 13 percent that is rs 1356 suppose okay find the price find the price of the article Excluding that, excluding that, okay. Suppose this question, okay. How to solve, okay? See here, question this one the price of a sort with 13 percent that is RS 1356. Find the price of the article excluding that by excluding that you have to find here okay that if you add 13 percent then rate is this it means here is given that rate is equals to 13 percent and this price is with that this price is with that it means selling price with that is given here okay rs 1356 it means we have to find what P price of article excluding that if you see yes this circle what you return there if you see there here is sp here is that percent here is that amount here is sp with that yes it means sp from sp with that how it comes 
when we add in sp the sp plus vat portion of sp if we do then comes the sp with vat so suppose here okay let let the price price excluding vat vat it means sp only is equals to x you can suppose it okay let suppose okay then now we can write what now we can find the vat amount yes vat amount how will you find it 13 percent of sp yes in selling price you find yes vat amount then 13 divided by 100 into x it means 13 x by 100 this is our vat amount now yes see here now sp with vat sp with vat then what you do sp plus vat amount yes vat amount amount then sp with vat given yes you can write here yes 1356 and sp is x we are supposing and vat amount just we find here yes then if you do it 1356 upon one suppose take the lcm 100 100 here multiplied 100 x plus 13 x and then you will get here cross multiplication 1356 into 100 is equals to 113 x if you do yes x is equals to 1356 into 100 divided by 113 do it by using the calculator if you use yes then you will get the answer x is equals to 1200 yes let us try yes use the calculator okay in this way that rate is given here selling price with that given here 1356 let the price excluding VAT yes we have to find the price excluding VAT means VAT bahet ko mulle means selling price without VAT SP nikalu sa ani VAT amount tapai le nikal dinu bhai 13 percent of SP kira wale VAT jai le pani VAT is always added in SP yo kura ek damai must तपाईले एकदम नोट गरेर दिमागमा राख्नु होला भ्याट जहिले पनि सेलिङ प्राइसमा लगाइन्छ डिस्काउन्ट जहिले पनि मार्ट प्राइसमा दिइन्छ यो दुईटा कुरा जहिले पनि यो माइन्डमा तपाईले मार्ट प्राइसमा डिस्काउन्ट दिने गरिन्छ त्यही भएर मार्ट प्राइसबाट डिस्काउन्ट गरे घटाएपछि सेलिङ प्राइस आउँछ सेलिङ प्राइसमा भ्याट जोडेपछि बल्ल सेलिङ प्राइस विथ भ्याट आउँछ त्यही भएर सेलिंग प्राइस विथ भ्याट भनेको सेलिंग प्राइस प्लस भ्याट अमाउन्ट अब यो क्वेशन एकैचोटी यो मैले पार्ट बाइ पार्ट किन गरेको भने एकदम कमजोर भन्दा कमजोर विद्यार्थी यस क्यान अंडरस्टैंड इट किन बिकज इफ यु युज दिस फर्मुला अल्सो देन अल्सो यु क्यान इन वन स्टेप यु क्यान फाइंड ओके दिस वन एसपी विथ भ्याट इज इक्वल्स टु एसपी प्लस भ्याट परसेंट अफ एसपी this is the formula. Formula to the Igos Hadesha the value of formula la unsa ya SP with that 1356 there say you x one unsa that person 13% of x gone unsa malay ek step with the Igos 1356 you will do x plus 13 divided by 100 into x and then after 13.56 and then after x is equals to 1356 divided by 1.3 by calculator you will get the x is equals to 1200 yes yes sorry never but if you do by this way no formula you formula china usp plus that amount yeah let me put in a you yeah price excluding uh, with that is equals to you can write x plus you can write this is still no need to write this one also you let me put seven that's either in this way, your basic kura haru mahi le tamai lai thorei discount ra ke vanchan bhat ra mark price bata discount ghata hune SP nikaal ne SP bata ma bhat jode ra SP with bhat nikaal ne kura haru tapa lai mahi le chai yasari yugarai 
यो टू मार्क्स को क्वेश्चन इट विल मे आर्स और वन क्वेश्चन मत सो सब वन मार्क्स टाइप क्वेश्चन फर्मुलास रिटेड क्वेश्चन सपोज एमपी एक्स सीपी वाई प्रफिट पर्सेंट जेड डिस्काउंट के देन फाइंड द रिलेशन बिट्विन देम दिस टाइप्स अफ क्वेश्चन विल आर्स मे बी इन इक्जाम अब हम थोड़े चाहे हम नेक्स्ट तीर हम लग्स यो सब दिज अल क्वेश्चन आर रिटेड विथ योर डेली एक्टिविटीज ये तब को प्रत्येक दैनिक क्रियाकलापसंग संबंध छे आई जस्ट टीच यू एबाउट मनी एक्सचेंज एट लास्ट जाने बेला में थोड़े मनी एक्सचेंज को कुरा याद छो मैं हिजो जाने बेला में तैयार थे नाउ मनी एक्सचेंज मीन्स व्हाट यस एट फर्स्ट अंडर स्टूड ओके इट मीन्स गिविंग और रिसिविंग You have to understand it. Of sum of money of one country equal in the value to uh, given sum of money. Okay, currency. You can say currency of another country. ओके दिस वेरी सिंपल हिजो मैं बुझाई सके फिर एक्सप्लेन आई थिंक इट नट निडेड टू यू देर इज अ बाइंग रेट एंड वन सेलिंग रेट ओके इफ यू गो तब बैंक में जानू देर इज अ रिटर्न फर द फरेन करेन्सी यस वेन वी एक्सचेंज आवर नेपलिज करेन्सी देन देर इज द बैंक देर इज अ रिटर्न बाइंग रेट एंड सेलिंग रेट तब इज द मिनिंग अफ दिस दिस मीन्स बाइंग रेट मीन्स द रेट अफ बैंक रेट अफ बैंक टू बाई टू बाई फरेन मनी और करेन्सी ओके करेन्सी एंड सेलिंग रेट मीन्स रेट बाई अ बैंक टू सेल टू सेल फरेन करेन्सी तब हेन भाला बाइंग रेट इज रिटर्न लेस यस लेस मीन्स लो एंड सेलिंग रेट इज रिटर्न हाई मोर अलवेज यस जैसे तैंक में जानू सेलिंग प्राइस उसको सेलिंग रेट उसे हाई राखे होते सपोज वन यूएस डलर वन हंड्रेड फोर यदि सेलिंग रेट छिया बाइंग रेट पक्क उसे कम राखे होस वन हंड्रेड थ्री राख एक रुपया पचास पैसा समथिंग लेस बट इट इज लेस बिकज दे हेव टू वाइल बाइंग द फरेन करेन्सी देन वी हेव टू पे द मोर मोर आवर नेपलिस एंड वाइल वी आर यस वाइल वी आर बाइंग एंड दे आर सेलिंग बैंक सेलिंग देन वी हेव टू पे द मोर मोर देन वी गेट द वन डलर यस वाइल दे वाइल वी गिव देम डलर दे रिटर्न अस लेस हाँ इवन वन रुपीज अल्सो बट लेस एंड इफ वी बाई द डलर देन दे टेक मोर ओके इवन वन रुपी अल्सो देन अल्सो मोर दे विल रिसीव इट मीन्स दिस आर द समेट सर लेट अस टेक वन इक्जापल ओके रिलेटेड टू दिस मनी एक्सचेंज क्वेश्चन सपोज एकॉर्डिंग टू द मनी एक्सचेंज रेट एक्सचेंज रेट ऑफ एनआरबी नेपाल राष्ट्रीय बैंक सपोज ओके द परचेजिंग एंड सेलिंग रेट्स ऑफ वन यूएस डॉलर ओके सपोज आर अमेरिकन डॉलर एन आर एस नेपलीज रुपीज वन थ्री वन एट थ्री पॉइंट सेवेन टू एंड सेलिंग रेट सपोज एन आर एस वन हंड्रेड फोर पॉइंट थ्री टू रेस्पेक्टिवली ओके सपोज देन क्वेश्चन आक्स ओके हाउ मेनी हाउ मेनी अमेरिकन डॉलर 
can be exchanged exchanged with with Nepalese rupees five uh, seven three seven six fifty seven thousand three hundred seventy six okay suppose this how will you do this question okay according to the money exchange rate of Nepal Rust Bank the purchasing and selling rate are given purchasing rate and selling rate here given okay and question is this your question of the Bible exam by the way idea our oh, yeah, buying rate selling rate the pilot data question was so did answer key how many American dollar yes okay this is the symbol okay can be exchange with Naples rupees this about our video he confused yani don't you are confused our cool use girl it over yani our purchase rate key selling it about the pay up a good news हामीले नेपाली रुपी लिएर गइरा छ अब हामीलाई के लिनु छ त त्यहाँबाट डलर लिनु छ भने पक्कै पनि उले अब डलर सेल गरिरा छ उले डलर सेल गरिरा छ भने सेलिंग रेट को आधारमा दिन्छ भनेर बुझ्ने ओके फर दैट भने यस्टरडे आई टोल्ड यू द मेथड अफ ओके सोल्भिंग द क्वेशन टु मेथड वन युनिटरी मेथड वन by using the chain rule अब यानी रहता है भाई ले chain rule if you use विद्यार्थी धरे chain rule मन पाओ में गर्सन unitary method also easy but uh, chain rule बात है actually हेरुस okay let us see using the selling rate yes then one okay dollar is equals to okay Nepali rupees how much one hundred four point three two yes then what we have to find this much okay then for it here we are writing one dollar is equals to naples yes rupees this then now here naples if you return then here you have to write the naples because so i had told you the x is equals to y then y is equals to z then z is equals to a it means this x always equals to a whatever currency you put here same here at last okay therefore one dollar means this naples rupees then here naples rupees how much we have to convert nrs five seven three seven six is equals to x dollar okay we don't know the dollar how much dollar we get yes late okay this one is late okay by chain rule you write here okay by chain rule either here you write or you supposing here and by chain rule okay so we have yes we can write we have okay one into this five seven three seven six is equals to one zero four point three two into x huh? or x is equals to now this one come here then divide yes yeah multiply but uh means divide yes Five seven three seven six upon the four one three two. You can multiply it. How much you get? Okay, divide multiply divide it. Okay, uh, dollar. How much? Five hundred fifty. Yes, five hundred fifty. In this way, uh, we can find by using the chain rule. Of chain rule, if you not yes use. Then by yes, one dollar unitary method also. By unitary method means for one one yota dollar, one ko eighty Nepali rupee, one one eight Nepali rupee, one ko slide divide karnu. Then eighty Nepali rupee, one ko lawyer multiply. If you do, you can find your money exchange and related question. There is. Uh, now yes, ma. Sometimes um, in money exchange, while exchangers or uh, banks exchangers they uh, take some commission commission pani linchan kai le kai to tyo commission sanga sambandhit question also we can let us do okay yo bujhnu bhayo sabai le la yai question ma tapai ko how um, uh, how much nepali rupees can be exchanged with uh, with uh, american dollar 500 bhande ko bhaye 
यहाँ नहीं होता पाइले अब बाइंग रेट तो पाइले यूज़ करने पड़ते हो उन्हें वह यहाँ नहीं रहते सही नेपाली रुपी कथी हमें पाँच अमेरिकन डलर लीएर गए वाले तो वाले पर सी त्यान ही रहा हमें ले बाइंग रेट चाहिए उले यूज़ करे रहा हमला ये नार्वी बैंक ले दिन थे ते यही कोई सर्मा ते संगरी लेटर कोई संसारल सुधे ओके यू कैन ट्राई इट ये यही कोई सर्मा लो मेरे यहाँ ले दिए तो पाइले आप ही ये लाई ट्राई करने वाला है हाउ मच नेपाली रुपीज एक्सचेंज विथ यूएस डॉलर फाइव हंड्रेड यो आप ही तो भाई बोले ट्राई करने वाला है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सपोज इफ द मनी एक्सचेंजर्स ओके एक्सचेंजर्स चार्जेस चार्जेस जीरो पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट कमीशन कमीशन फाइंड नेपाली नेपाली रुपीस ओके रुपीस रुपीस अब हम लोग समय सकी सकी ना लाए कुछ है वार्निंग बेल लगी सकी कुछ है रिक्वायर्ड टू एक्सचेंज डॉलर ट्वेंटी फाइव हंड्रेड विथ रेट वन डॉलर इज इक्वल्स टू आरएस हंड्रेड सपोज यस यो अब हम लोग समय सकी सके कुछ है विद्यार्थी में लोग धेरे पूरा आरु पढ़ाऊं चुका है नेरा है कुछ ही है तारा पनी यो प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस समाज हमी पुगना साके रहो नेक्स्ट भोली जान सो आज यो क्वेश्चन हमी कौन कुल करो यो कमीशन टाइप्स को क्वेश्चन पनी ये तबाई को एग्जामिनेशन हरु माइस सके को क्वेश्चन होयो if I am defined, Nepali rupees required to exchange dollar 2500 with 1 dollar is equals to RS 100. अब यानि रहा तवाई ले की वरूस, यो 1 dollar is equals to यो देखो इसे तवाई वो condition. अब ऐसे मा यहां, यहां 1 dollar is equals to Nepali rupees यो लेखनूस by chain rule. अब इन Nepali rupees को दिया हुचा मने यहां X Nepali rupees तवाई ले लेट गर दिन होला. रुपीज यहाँ भाई पच्ची यहाँ पर नहीं रुपीज ही रखने हो यस अन्य यहाँ नहीं रहता भाई को डॉलर नेपाली रुपीज तब भाई को दे दे चाहिए ना नेपाली रुपीज यस मानो भाई डॉलर तब भाई को कती एक्स इन जाना सा ट्वेंटी फाइव हंड्रेड रखने उनसा अन्य यहाँ बटे लाई गर्नु उनसा एक्स जिकल्स तो तब भाई चार वटा जीरो यो आये तब भाई को अब यो तब भाई को दिस वन इज योर ट्वेंटी फाइव हंड्रेड डॉलर इन नेपाली रुपीस बट हेयर वी हैव टू ऐड द कमीशन अब यही बात तब भाई को जीरो ऐसे ही को तब भाई को जीरो पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट फाइंड द कमीशन कमीशन फाइंड कर रहे हैं त्यो कमीशन यो ट्वेंटी फाइव � निकालने से ऐस को यो जून नेपाली रुपीस तमाई को आयो जून नेपाली रुपीस तपाइले चाहिए को छा तो एक्सचेंज करना ते ती डॉलर एक्सचेंज कर पची तमाइले नेपाली भी पाउन हुए ते ऐस को बल्ला जीरो पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट कमीशन निकालने से देन ऐड हेयर ऐड करे रहा नहीं तमाई को टोटल जाती आउटसाइड यो कमीश आज आपको हमें ले बेसिक डिस्काउंट मार्ट प्राइस और उसको कुरा र मॉनी एक्सचेंज को सिंपल प्रॉब्लम्स नहीं आउ चाहता हमें लेटर सही लीना पड़ देना सिर्फ इतनी ध्यान दीने कून जब आप बाइंग रेट सेलिंग रेट दे रहे हैं कौन सा कून बेला बाइंग रेट कून बेला सेलिंग रेट यूज़ करने रा कती बेला हमें ले चाहिए तो कमीशन को कराया पसी तो यूज़ करने दिस ऑल इफ यू कीप इट इन योर माइंड यू कैन सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन वेरी इजीली थैंक्स टू ऑल माय डियर स्ट्रेंड्स हो सी यू टुमारो